Yo, what is up guys? This is now like back with another video. Today we are here at Pipeline. And I'm gonna be showing you guys the comparison between the Discraft Zone and the Westside Disc Harp. And I'm gonna be telling you guys what my opinions are on which is the better approach disc. I'm gonna be showing you guys the profile. First, I'm gonna be showing you guys how these things fly. I'm gonna be showing you guys um, what is what are they useful for and all that jazz to it. The profile first, um, the Get Freaky Zone is basically more flat. It has a blunt nose and a sharper kind of edge that can cut through the wind and a little bit better, I think, than the harp. It feels really good for forehand and backhand, in my opinion. Um, 250 foot shots and in. The harp is basically the same thing, board flat, just a little bit different on the um, bottom. It has blunt nose, same thing as the zone, but it has a bead and it's not as sharp as the zone. Um, it's more slower. Harp is the speed is four, the glide is three, and the turn is zero and a fade of three. And then on the zone, I'm pretty sure it has a speed of like three or four, correct me if I'm wrong. It has a glide of like um, zero or one, and then like a fade of three. So as you can tell, it might be a little bit faster, but to me, it's kind of slower than the um, zone, right? So I'm gonna go with the, um, BT medium, just throw it flat, right down the gap, should kind of absorb the ground well. And since this is a different plastic than that VIP, um, it should not have as much skip. It hit a tree, but I think it still would have just kind of absorbed the ground and not had so much skip. On the other hand, the zone, I think it'll just hit the ground and ha have that um, gradual skip. I don't know, see, but it had so much more ground play than the um, harp did. And comes out of my hands so smooth. It's so um, just good and clean. Um, release. That's why I love that. I love the zone. So we're gonna throw some more um, harder on the next hole um, and just see how it handles power, both of them, and compare it for I guess how, how fast they go. Two is a little bit longer. It's 250 uphill. I'm gonna go with this this zone and just watch as I hit it hard. Probably on the foot flat and it'll just hold it the whole way. So, so good. I'll go with the BT medium. I'll throw it flat. This one is beat in, so it might flip, but I think I'm just expecting it to go dead straight. see it's a lot more bead in so I put on a little bit of hydro pop the flat throw dead straight get freaky zone on the same line as that um other zone and it should just go dead straight so. yeah as you can tell from the flight of that deer I think um, in my opinion, that the zone is a fast fly disc, just because when I threw the harp, it went slower, um, and it had glide, but it, it just didn't go as fast as the zone. I think the numbers are wrong on those. That's my opinion. So this one is a flat. A little bit of headwind. Heiser just held the whole way. That's what that this is um, good for. So I'm gonna throw them on the next hole 
and four up shots. We'll show you guys what they can do on four hands. I'm hoping in the middle of the fairway, this is the perfect distance for this kid. I'm gonna go to the disc up. Kid, zone first. Absolutely parked. So, um, harp and the harp had a lot less reaction. Um, that's why the zone is better for more skippy shots for approaches because it um, really hits the ground. It doesn't absorb it as much as the on either out left and but still just holds the whole way and I'm gonna throw this um, BT medium harp and if I throw it on hyzer it should just hold it the whole way As you can see, those are what those good discs are good for. Um, they're, I think, they're the best approach discs there are besides the A2. I currently don't bag any of the harps. Um, I would if I was on Trilogy, but I just think the Zone is a better approach disc. That's my opinion. I'd like to see your guys' opinion in the comments below. Yeah, that was the um, comparison between the harp and the zone yeah that's the end of the video i hope you guys like this video subscribe for more content and help your boy to get to 300 subscribers through the algorithm i think about like 90 percent of you guys that are watching my videos are not subscribed so that'll help me out you guys would go down and subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next video peace out